Welcome to today's demo of F5's Application Security Manager product and Oracle's Database Firewall product. This is a recorded demo designed to show the integration of these two best-of-breed security products from F5 and Oracle. The F5 ASM is an ICSA certified Layer 7 web application firewall that will be used to protect a website while the Oracle database firewall will be used to protect an Oracle database. This demo will show a web client using the OWASP Insecure web application, which is running on Oracle WebLogic and Oracle Database. This demo will walk through a series of SQL injection attacks on the website. First, without the F5 ASM web firewall, and then a second time with the F5 ASM firewall. We will show how these two security products, when used together, can provide enhanced reporting, better protection, and improved visibility into the users and transactions on the website. Deploying these security technologies together can give you a powerful, flexible, and robust defense in depth security architecture for protecting database-driven web applications. First, a little background on the demo itself. Here is a simplified diagram of our demo web application and database environment. From left to right, we have a standard client using a web browser, then a big IP from F5 running the Application Security Manager web firewall software, and then an Oracle WebLogic server hosting the OWASP Insecure web application. Next is the Oracle Database Firewall running on a dedicated Oracle Enterprise Linux server protecting the Oracle database. And last, we have the Database Firewall Management Server for admin access to the Database Firewall web console. When a user attempts a SQL injection attack on the website, this user's metadata is captured and logged directly to the Oracle Database Firewall Management Server. The Database Firewall will analyze the SQL statement and apply its policy independently. We will then show what the Database Firewall reports look like with the additional web client metadata from ASM. Okay. Let's run the demo. The first scenario is without F5 ASM protecting the website. First, we log in normally and access the website and then log out. Next, we log in again, this time attempting a SQL injection attack in the username field. You can see that the SQL injection attack was successful without knowing the correct password. Going to the database firewall console, we look for the SQL injection attack event, click on it, and see the SQL injection request. Notice that there are no client details associated with this event. The second scenario is exactly the same process, but this time with F5's ASM web firewall protecting the website. Here again, we start with a normal login and then log out. Then we try the same SQL injection attack, which is successful. Now we go look at F5's ASM configuration and confirm that SQL injection attacks will be reported. We click Go and see that the SQL injection attack was detected and click on the link to see the details in the report.
Now we go back to the database firewall console and see that additional events have been logged coming from the F5 ASM. Looking at these events, we now see an F5 icon has been added and clicking on the event shows us the additional information provided from the F5. Details such as the client's source IP address, the browser type, the web server, the web page, and the URL they were accessing, the HTTP objects, session information, and their cookies. In summary, all of this additional contextual client information can be used to tighten both web and database security policies, investigate attacks, and provide enriched reporting about what is happening to your database-driven web applications. Thank you for taking the time to watch this integration demo between F5's Application Security Manager Web Firewall and the Oracle Database Firewall. For more information on ASM, please see f5.com. For more information on the Database Firewall, please see oracle.com.